how long, oh please, how long do I have to stay in the job? First, when you are in a conservative business, which government contracting and the government itself often are, the answer is different than for a lot of the high tech world and a lot of other fields. But for any type of job, no matter what your field, the first question is, how senior are you? The more senior you are, the longer you are expected to stay in a job because it takes longer to make that contribution and they want to see the contributions you made to the company. The more junior you are, obviously, the easier it is to take a job for a shorter period of time and not have anybody question it too much. So what happens if you have a, had a job really short period of time? Maybe it's a few months, maybe it's a little less than a year or it's a year and you're concerned about that. First, be sure on all your marketing materials that you have achievements associated with that job. You'd be surprised how many people forget that. Secondly, if it's really a short period of time, you may want to talk to the recruiters. You may want to put it in a cover letter, a reason for why that job was so short. Now, sometimes this is an obvious reason. You moved. You went to a company that had financial problems. The contract ended perhaps more, sooner than they expected. Um, and those are easy to say, and you can put a lot of that right on your resume and stop the questions. But if there are questions, you need to be positive. Don't say terrible things about the employer, however bad it was. Do talk about the scope of the job wasn't what you were hired for. Do talk about you needed to move on because you felt you weren't effective in their culture, but don't say anything negative about your boss or the employer themselves. That's the kiss of death for the next employer. Think too, if you are transitioning military, 40% of all such people leave their first job within the first year. So you need a good explanation also as to why you left, but you also need to remember, don't be defensive. Sure, maybe you made a mistake in your job hunt, but don't be defensive about it. And that don't be defensive advice is critical to anybody. Government contracting and the government themselves are somewhat more conservative. And so you want that positive set of achievements and that positive explanation. Good hunting.